Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's a girlfriend along with back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, do not forget to subscribe. Like I said, my name is Wani Longu, and on this channel, we post reaction videos each and every day so if there's something that you guys want us to react to let us know by dropping the link in the comment section below and we'll, and we'll be more than glad to do it or i'll do it um make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe uh a big shout out to everyone that has subscribed to our channel so far thank you for subscribing thank you for liking thank you for commenting uh sharing um doing the most you guys are just doing the most thank you very much and thank you for 17,000 subscribers you guys are the best i hope you guys are doing all right and may you stay blessed i'm not sure if someone suggested this but if it was suggested a big shout out to the person that suggested this so today i'm going to be reacting to i believe in god but not religion abdel rahim green without wasting time let's get into the video one of the things you hear people saying these days is yeah i believe in god but i don't believe in organized religion you see and i always find that ridiculous because the whole purpose of religion is to be organized religion is like a systematic spiritual athletic training program that's why I call it being a spiritual athlete because every imagine you said to an athlete say well an athlete said well I I believe in athletics but I don't believe in having an organized training program well okay some people very occasionally will get away with it but most people they will be laughed at it's like you are not ever going to reach the top unless you are very organized and you are dedicated not only in your exercise in your diet this is interesting you see an athlete just can't eat anything you think you can be a true athlete and um, compete at the highest level and just eat smarties and snicker bars and ice cream and paratha huh? and biryani no Unless you're the only thing you're racing for is a big belly, yeah, then you know that's the particular discipline. <laughs> no, no. They are very strict about what they eat. Very strict. And actually, sometimes even a small imbalance, just having a sugary drink when you're not supposed to, can literally destroy your performance. It will spike your blood sugar levels. You will not be burning fats the way you're supposed to. And if you're competing in a race, say a different type of race, uh, a long race, you need a different type of metabolism burning your fuel in a different way. Right? If you eat the wrong type of foods, you, won't be able, you will not be able to compete. Your body will just literally shut down. So this is... This is in this field of athletics so I say that Islam is actually like Allah has given us a training program he tells us to race for forgiveness and race for this paradise and Allah gives us a training program and you will never be competitive spiritually and you will never be successful on a spiritual level. You will never reach that goal. You are never going to reach that podium unless you follow the program. You need to follow the program. Honestly, you like how he's put it. It's like anyone can understand. Uh, children can understand. Adults can understand. I really, really love people that can, uh, can give examples that make sense. For you to achieve a goal, you have to put in work. For you to make something a habit, you have to repeatedly do it. For you to be an athlete, there's some, and you want to win, there's certain things that you have to do in life, certain things that you have to eliminate from your life, from your diet. It just makes sense. For you to want to live a healthy life, then you must change or look at your diet this explanation was just the best of I've, I've had or listened to in a while 
otherwise let me know what you guys think what you have to say about the message of the video or just feel free to give your good opinions don't say anything mean this is not that channel and yeah make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next reaction video